many years ago when I was in the light horse, <coughs> it came through about the middle of 1918 that no horses would be taken back to Australia. Well, that was a very severe blow to some of these old troopers. I don't think I can stand the thought of my old faithful hack just crawling round old Cairo with a jibbo on his back. Or oh, perhaps some pommy tourist out in Palestine will find my broken-hearted charger with a wooden plough behind. No, I think I'll have to shoot him and tell a likely lie. He stumbled in a wild dog hole and then lay down to die. I know I'll be caught marshalling, but I'm darned if I'm inclined to go back to Australia and leave my pal behind. In days to come, we'll ride out west and cross the range again. We'll hear the bush birds singing in the green trees after rain. We'll canter through the Mitchell grass and face the bracing wind. But we'll have other horses then, for these must stay behind. Before the fire at night will yarn, about old Sinai, eye, we'll fight our battles all again, and as the days go by, we'll all, we'll have old friends to greet us, and the bush girls will be kind, but oft our thoughts will wander to the horses left behind.